Every teacher got to see it firsthand or met back with their groups to share with them because we toured other schools so we kind of pinched what was good here and pinched what didn't work there to make ours better than. Richmond Hill Middle School principal Helen Herndon walks me through the current school built in the 1970s. The replacement school will be everything this 30 plus year old building is not. If you stand here like from the main office as you can see you see down to the band room and about 10 of the classrooms. But what you don't see is a whole, two, a whole eighth grade, the entire seventh grade, none of the gym, none of the cafeteria. And that's gonna be the biggest difference when you stand with that pinwheel design and can see everything. And that's a big deal, especially with safety. Safety is the biggest thing. And we have lots of security doors within the building. So even if you come in the main office, you don't, you can't go anywhere but right there. The new school will have 93 classrooms, replacing 57 here. This one old tech lab here turns into three at the new school, equipped with projectors and an instant response system, allowing teachers to give students instant feedback. I think the new features, um, as far as technology goes, will keep them definitely um, engrossed in the lesson. I think the layout of the school is going to be um, very conducive to changing classes. So the two years can't come fast enough. They cannot huh? come. Where's the bulldozer? Where's the shovel? I can lay bricks. Let's get going with it. In Richmond Hill, Randy Hempel, WSAV News 3.